Hey guys, this is Xavier with Gotta Be Mobile, and I want to show you one of the reasons I actually prefer Android over iOS. Now, I still carry my iPhone 5S as my primary device, but there's just so many features in Android that really, really make it difficult to use an iPhone these days as my sole uh, mobile computing device. So, I'm going to show you how Android handles uh, voice transcription and how iPhone handles uh, voice to text, and I'll show you why I really prefer. Uh, Android's implementation. So here I have an empty note and what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit the microphone and you'll see that uh, as I speak the text just appears on the screen in, in near real time. So let's do this. Hit record. This is Xavier with Gotta Be Mobile and as I speak my voice turns into text. Period. It isn't always perfect, comma, but this is a much better way to type on a mobile device than to hunt and peck with my thumbs, period. As you can see, I already have several mistakes in this message, period, but I can always go back and hit autocorrect, period. So as you can see, I've got a few misspellings, but I can go back and tap here and here, anything that's underlined, and correct it really easily. So as you can see, voice transcription is pretty powerful on Android. Uh, the, now, iOS has a similar feature. The problem is when you hit the microphone, uh, it doesn't actually show you what's going on. It actually waits till you're done speaking, and this is really annoying. So let me show you an example. This is Xavier, and I'm typing with my voice on my iPhone 5S right now, comma, but unfortunately I can't see what I'm typing, period. This is a big, big problem if I have a really long message to write by email, comma, or I want to write an entire article using my voice instead of my thumbs on my iPhone, period. And sometimes you can forget about what you already said or what you already included in the message, comma, and that's a real problem, period. The other problem is that iOS just times out after about 30 seconds. It'll interrupt you and actually make it so you can't continue typing. Be and there you saw it. It just in the middle of a sentence, it cut me off and very quickly uploaded and transcribed the text. As you can see, I'm on a super fast internet connection though. And because of that, it's almost instantaneous. Now, if I'm out in the real world on 3G or 4G, that transcription doesn't always happen accurately, or very quickly, I'm sorry, and I can continue talking for an entire paragraph, and it's not until I'm done and I get a little message about Siri not being available that um, it doesn't work. So, much prefer Android over iOS, at least in this regard. If you have to draft a lot of emails, if you have to draft documents on your mobile device, you might want to take a look at the HTC One M8 or a similar Android device. This is Xavier with Gotta Be Mobile, and this is a demo of Siri and uh, voice dictation on Android.